Hi. I was just pondering a thought. <clears throat> you know, a lot of people spend lots of energy, so much energy being spent trying to appear interesting. People focus a lot of their energy on appearing, you know, trying to be interesting. <laughs> it's usually a waste of, it's usually a waste of time simply because if someone's interested, they're interested. So you're focusing all this energy on trying to be interesting as if you can see yourself through the, through the eyes of other people. When it comes to relationships, I mean, that's why we're trying to be interesting. We're looking to relate and communicate on something, joy, uh, 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 compassion, identification, socialization. What, what, what happens is the, the thing with relationships is that if you are in a relationship to extract something, to take away something, to gain something, or everything's supposed to be better because of this individual, that usually, usually doesn't, doesn't work as well. What does work is when you get into a relationship with someone you want to share things with, passion, emotions, things, and feelings, and, and, and activities, trust, morale, ethics, values, you know? I'm not going to say you know what I'm saying because that's what's the sense of me asking if you know what I'm saying. There's no sense of me talking to you if I don't believe you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? And it don't even sound right. You know what I'm saying. I don't have to ask you. You know what I'm saying? Because then it makes it seem like I don't know what the hell I'm saying or I don't believe I know what I'm saying. There's another thing. Knowing and believing. A lot of people don't realize there's a big difference between knowing and believing. Because if you believe in it, it means you don't know it, but you believe it. And if you know it, you don't need to believe it, because hell, you know it. Relationships aren't easy. Most people are in relationships are looking for help, and they're not even wise enough or humble enough to be honest about it. Sometimes when you tell the truth about your, 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 your motive, the person is so open and willing and, and anxious and, and able, having the wherewithal to embrace you love you till you can love yourself. Some people can love you even with all the crapola you do. Even with all your mess that you bring to the table. Some people can still, because they know how to find love. The way to find love is bring it. You are the source. You don't go find nobody looking for love. You bring love. You plant love. And see if it grows. I'm going to let y'all go with that. Need I say more? <laughs> Y'all have a good night. Peace.